everyone, Keith here, Tips and Tricks HQ. In this video, I'm continuing on with a series of videos I to demonstrate the simple PayPal shopping cart plugin. In this video here, I want to explain how to use the digital download option um, for a product. Now, here's a here's what a product looks like. Um, I'm using the dis the attractive display box, which is uh, there's a particular short code that you can use to show your product. Um, in this display box and it'll generate it'll show the image and the title of the product the description the price and then of course the add to cart the but add to cart button that also has the product name and description coded into it now the way this works if in general if we were to s just leave this as is um, here's the code here I'll show you uh, the name the price the thumbnail and description and we can add a shipping value in there and some variations too if it were a physical product at any rate this is this short code generates this and since it is a digital product um, we would almost have to provide the download to that digital product on the thank you page that um, the customers redirected to after the purchase but if we'd rather show that, uh, if we'd rather provide a product link in an email to the customer, which makes more sense, that way if there was more than one product on, for sale on our website, they would only be able to gain access to the products they purchased, of course. So we could set that up. Um, to do that, it just requires an extra parameter in this shortcode here. And we can get that here. Just uh, it's file underscore URL. and then you provide the URL and the link right within there and I already added the PDF file to the media library so I'm going to open that media library in a new window click on edit underneath the PDF double click this copy it to the clipboard and this is the complete URL so then we can just paste that URL right in in this short code and it's missing a quote on the end. I'm going to put that in there and save draft. This is going to look identical. It's just that the way now the button is coded with um, the proper information and the customer will now get an email with this with this link so they can download the product after purchase. The only thing that really has to be changed, I mean besides adding this new parameter into whatever shortcode you use, whether you use the display product shortcode or or the standard add to cart button. Um, the only other thing that needs to be changed is in your PayPal profile and what you would want to do, go to my account, then profile, then my selling tools and look at for instant payment notifications and just click on update and then make sure that's turned on. And once that's turned on, um, the plugin will handle the rest. It'll process the transaction and send an email to the customer with the proper link or links um, for downloading the digital products. And that's it. Thanks a lot for watching. Have a great night.